Hello everyone and welcome back to the show and today on this episode I'm going to share with you the real way to cure your poverty and that state of constantly being broke, right? I'm going to share with you a simple tip that's going to solve all, okay, most of your money problems once and for all. Hello friend, this is the voice of Ademola Murebishi. Hello friend and welcome back to the show. There is this important concept I learned you know, over the past couple of years as I observed you know, the coming and goings in life, right? And I realized something, you see, it's not like you can't fix your current broke state. It's not like you can't make much more money than you currently make. It's not like you can't create an abundance of wealth and prosperity. But the problem is we are too impatient, right? We want to make money and we want to make it now. <laughs> you understand? And here's the thing, you see, Understand that this life is governed by principles. Principles, you understand? There will always be a time for seed, there will always be a time for harvest. The problem we have is that we're not willing to sow the kind of seeds that will give us the kind of harvest we are looking for. I want to think about it for a moment, right? Think about it for a moment. Now, I think about it, you realize that every fruit you eat today is a product of a tree, right? Not a shrub. Every fruit you eat today is the product of a tree. So if you want to have an abundant harvest in your future, you better be planting trees today. This is the thinking, this is the thinking. Now, it's not like you, my friend, watching me right now, it's not like you don't know what you need to do in order to make it big, not to become you know, a millionaire or a billionaire or whatever it is you ought to be with your life, right? But the challenge is you want it now, you want it today, you want it within the next one hour. My guy, life doesn't work that way. You know it doesn't work this way, my friend, right? If you want to have super success in your life, if you want a life of achievement, you must be willing to, 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 to be patient in your thinking. You have to be patient with the way you want results. Be patient with results, but be impatient with your actions, right? That means every single day you should take action in line with your long-term vision, all right? So, you know, if you keep on doing daily deals, daily also, it's going to get you fed today, tomorrow, but you and I know that you are not going to create the kind of prosperity you want to create. So, I mean, you want to make it big with your book project, for example, but you understand that before you can start selling books at scale, you have to build a community, and you can't build a community overnight. It is going to take time, you understand? Serious things is always going to take time, but we are not usually willing to invest that time, and so we are, we are impatient, and that impatience means we we keep on doing things poorly. We keep on taking short-term decisions that actually hurt us in the long term. Remember that saying? They say, um, no, never wise, cover foolish, which means you're making decisions today that look okay because it's making you cover. But in the long term, those decisions are not making you anything and it's a total waste of your time. So if there's one thing I'm going to counsel you to do, if you are serious about fixing your brokenness once and for all, if you are serious about getting on the path to true super success, if you are serious about getting on the path to making it big in life and all of that, you have to, you have to understand that there is a need for you to just chill, okay, sit down and take a long term view, take a long term view, take a long term view. You know, I wonder I was sharing this with a friend and the guy said, Mr. Hem, I don't have 10 years, I don't have 5 years. I, I said, guy, you have, you have the time, you have the space. If you if you insist you don't have the, the patience, you don't have the allowance to take a long term view, then you keep on going around in circles. Merry go round, merry go round, merry go round. When will you wake up, my friend, and see and realize that you, there is no shortcut to these things, okay? If you want to get these things done, you have you must be patient in your with results. You must be patient and embrace the principle of long-term thinking. If you take a long-term view and you're able to plant what I call a tree, if you plant the tree, then you are able to, now that the tree is there, you can enjoy the fruits forever. Your children unborn can enjoy the fruits forever. But if you keep on with this your short-term thinking, you will never, never break out of poverty. Why don't you repeat after me this morning? Say, God daily loves me with benefits. I am bold and strong. Every day, in every way, I am getting better and better. Thank you so much for watching this video. May you grow without limits. Yes, you. Have a great day.